welcome to our press conference. We're here to speak about food safety, and we're very proud to have from the prestigious Pennsylvania State University, a renowned land-grant institution, a leader in the agricultural industry, an associate professor of horticulture, uh, Dr. Ruthie Aberson. Dr. Foster, I'm here to address the issue of food safety. Um, with improved methods of testing, it allows us as researchers to conduct experiments and to detect and monitor chemicals as our foods. Laws and systems are set to ensure that um, the food that we eat and buy from supermarkets are safe. The Environmental Protection Agency, the Food and Drug Administration, the U.S. Department of Agriculture, and state pesticides regula regulatory programs are some of the many systems to monitor food safety. Take the EPA, Environmental Protection Agency, for example. They set tolerance levels or maximum legal limits for pesticides. They will only allow pesticides to be used if the estimated risk of it causing cancer is one in a million over the average lifespan of 70 years. But truthfully, I believe that the risks are hard to prove because there are other contributing factors. Um, the the abandoned, abandoned, is the abandoned, Sorry, I can't even say that word. Abusing pesticides are that they have allowed crops to expand to new geographical areas, to expand the product slide shelf, and to increase product volume, and to improve appearance. Although the public may not favor the use of pesticides, most nutritionists and dietitians agree that it is not a top concern, unlike, eating, unlike educating the public on portion control. I will now address questions. Thank you. What questions do we have for our distinguished lecturer from Penn State? Uh, Ruthie, a question I have is, do you know how much does it cost for a chemical to go from the a design phase to the implementation phase in the industry? How many years and how many dollars of testing and safety and inspection? Um, that, I'm sure, that I am sure, unsure of, but I know that it outweighs the... Um, advantages of using it because that way it has, pesticides have um, played a major role to increase the availability to um, consumers. So I think it helps the economy in that way. We have one more question. Lydia. Are organic pesticides being used now? Um, that I, I don't know either, but I know that um, there is a program called Integrated Pest Management, which is um, an environmental approach. Um, this includes like crop rotations, um, destruction of uh, crop debris, and biological control. Thank you. Show sure, our appreciation. And